What I have here today is the brand new for 2024 Home Depot animated servo, 5.5 feet animated Fear Valley Wolf. Now this is an animatronic I've been really wanting since I first saw the videos. When I saw the box images, I thought, I thought it was just all right. You know, your average run of the will, run of the mill, sorry, wolf prop. I didn't expect this to be anything more than just Cerberus, but I've seen a video of the two side by side and I actually couldn't believe how small Cerberus looked next to him. But sorry for no unboxing on him or Hellspawn. I have a broken wrist and it's recovering for 10 days. It's taken like nine more days to recover. So I couldn't do any more unboxings. But I might do one later this week with uh, Jack of Spades because his setup can't be that hard. But anyways, I really like this guy's like chunks of flesh that he has. It makes him look really zombified. I'm glad they added that. I probably, I don't, I'm not too sure if I would have bought this if it didn't have that. Because it would just look like a wolf. I also really like the um, servos in his mouth. Um, it's better in person. He's also super loud. He has super booming audio. And he's also super long. Like, I know it doesn't look like it on video, but he's actually really big. Like, this is probably, like, maybe, like, five feet long. And for $200, this is definitely a steal. He has glowing eyes. I don't think I've ever seen this eye design on a prop before. This is also like a really different setup. I've never set up a prop like this before. Cause usually you start at like a base, but this one, you like the base is basically this. And you start and you put like the legs on and you put the tail on and you put the head on with these screws. And I wasted a bunch of time finding a uh, screwdriver just to find out it came with a uh, wrench for it in the box. It's very, Good. I bet. I doubt a uh, spirit would have done that if they sold this. Probably would have went for like three hundred dollars at spirit. But yeah, definitely better than Cerberus. Um, gives off a super zombified vibe and a very classic Halloween vibe. I don't think we've ever seen like the lip gum servos before on the prop. At least for retail, we should have gotten it in twenty twenty two for Monty. Because then he would have looked like the actual Jolly Chimp. And that would have been really cool. I would have bought him for sure. Anyways, I'm going to um, activate him. Also, he has like a really cool tail wagging movement. Which is a nice addition to like the already existing uh, snarling servos. So, with $200, I'd say uh, you should get this one. I had to get it off the top shelf because it had like a bunch of animatronics like on the floor, but I didn't have this one or they didn't have jo Jack of Spades. And those were the two I was aiming for. And I saw the werewolf, I mean, Fear Valley Wolf on the top shelf. And I'm like, and I, I contacted a worker, they got a forklift and they took it off the high shelves. Now I noticed like they took a whole pallet and it had like Soul Slasher, Fear Valley Wolf, obviously Captain Cuts and like the skull archway. This forklift stabbed right through the Soul Slasher's box on one of them. So that one's probably broken now. I hope no one buys it. I might ask for a markdown on it because of the damage box. But yeah, it kind of was, kind of took a long time to get this one because surprisingly he was the fastest to sell out on the Home Depot website, which I was not, I mean, besides Chucky, but that's Chucky. But I did not expect this one to sell out so fast. Same with Jack of Spades. I expected Levitating Reaper to sell out, who um, is actually half assembled right down there. But without further ado, I'm going to stop rambling and I'm going to uh, plug this thing in. Let me turn the volume up first.
Now, if you're in the market for like a wolf or a werewolf or a dog prop, I definitely consider this with the small price of two hundred dollars for something as cool as this. I say you're getting what you're paid for, cause that spirit this would easily be like two eighty maybe. I definitely recommend this over uh, Cerberus. I definitely like invest like an extra seventy dollars just to get this one, cause he's way better. Like I've seen him next to Cerberus in a video just way better i didn't even know cerberus was that small until i saw this video but this guy's actually enormous whether you buy this or you see it in store you're gonna really see how giant this thing is but you never know because some things look really small in stores um but when you get them in your house they look super big like take um black heart for example he looked tiny in the stores but in your home he looked really big so it might it, it could be the same for this guy definitely worth 200 bucks and um hopefully i'll have a uh, jack of spades unboxing sometime this week or next week